Hi, my name's Jane McClelland. I'm author of How to Starve Cancer. And I wrote this because uh, several years ago, I had, almost 20 years ago, I had stage four cancer. And I worked out a system to starve the cancer stem cell, which at the moment is not being treated by conventional treatments. So we have chemo, we have radiotherapy, those wipe out the fast dividing cell, but it doesn't get rid of the cancer stem cell, which gets left behind. And this is slow dividing, and it ends up creating its daughter cells and then creating new tumors. We need to treat both the fast dividing cell and the cancer stem cell at the same time. So what I have done is designed a system which is a triangle to start the three macros in the diet, which are carb, fat, and protein. And I've worked out the feeding pathways that cancer uses so that you can work out the system to actually starve your cancer. And if you block one of those pathways, you have to remember that the cancer cell is very wily. It uses another pathway. So it's always about a combination, blocking more than one pathway so that you end up getting synergy with cocktails. Now these cocktails can be off-label drugs, which are cheap, old, off-pattern drugs. I used a combination myself. I used Dipridamol, Lovastatin, Etodilac, and Metformin. So those are the ones that I use, but there are other old off-label drugs which are also really useful for starving your cancer. So I have worked out uh, a way to actually do that and uh, you can work out how to starve your cancer. It's not specific to one type of cancer. The metabolism of cancer affects every different cancer, but in slightly different ways. So there will be a different dominant pathway for your cancer and I'm helping you to work that out in the book. Now I've just launched my second edition, which is how to starve cancer and then kill it with ferroptosis. Ferroptosis is uh, a new concept. It was only discovered in 2012. This is different to apoptosis. Apoptosis is what oncologists try and achieve by killing the cancer in a particular way. It's cancer cell suicide. But ferroptosis is using cancer's desire for iron to rust and oxidize the cancer and actually create cell death in that way. So it's really exciting, very new, hardly anybody's using it yet. It's only really known by clinical researchers. I wanna stimulate a global revolution. It's gonna be a patient-led revolution because you guys are gonna to have to educate your doctors. They're too busy to be looking at this, but if you can read this, know what you're talking about, and then try and get your oncologist to have a look at this and maybe try and use some of the traditional treatments which will also help. There are things like um, alaparib, lipatinib, even methotrexate and cisplatin will all help ferroptosis. So these are things you can maybe ask for in combination with some other things that, that there's a special diet, there's uh, supplements and there are other a specific set of off-label drugs as well. So please take a look at that. I, in the description below, I will go through lots of links for my website, which is howtostarvecancer.com. You can find my online course. You can find lots of other links and resources as well. Um, and uh, if you are struggling with the science, I strongly recommend going and having a look on Teachable for my online course, How to Starve Cancer. It will really help you understand the basic science behind what I do. I have many doctors, many researchers now following me. Uh, this is based on science. So please, please, if you know anybody with cancer, please share this video with them and uh, see you in my Facebook group and see you hopefully on here. I will be uh, producing more videos for you to try and break down some of the science for you.